my soulmate left me today. All that's left of him now, is a pair of socks that probably fell out of his suitcase, and a note labeled, read me, that I found on the kitchen counter. I picked it up and started to read. I just can't take it anymore. Jess, you know I love you, and I always will, but over the last few months, things have gotten really, really bad for me. Yes, it's her, she's following me again and I'm scared that if she found you, she'd kill you. I'm sorry, I wish I could go into more details, but you'll be home in a few minutes, and I don't want to have to tell you any of this to your face. It would destroy me to see you cry. David. Suddenly, the front door creaked open. Instinctively, I grabbed a knife off from the knife rack and ran into the pantry. Hello, called a woman from the entranceway. I didn't answer. Instead, I cracked the pantry door open just enough to see the note on the counter. Anyone in here? She yelled, walking closer to the kitchen. I'm not going to hurt you. She stepped into the kitchen. There was a small Swiss army knife in her hand. She picked up the note and started to read. Within seconds, she started crying hysterically. The woman fell to her knees and dropped the knife. I ignored every logical thought in my brain. Kicked the door open and thrust the knife into her stomach. Welcome home, Jessica, I said. Twisting the knife with a bright smile on my face.